But Kennedy walks around at 220 20 pounds. This is a big kid, only one inch reach advantage. All right, fans, here we go. A middleweight special attraction scheduled three five minute rounds. Introducing the referee in charge, Mark Matheny. All right, guys. Referee Mark Matheny about to get things started. Tim right, Kennedy let's go, let's fight. coming off that hard fought loss for the vacant strike force middleweight titles in the red gloves. Melvin Manhoof on the receiving end of the strike force knockout of the year when he was dominating Robbie Lawler last January before getting KO'd and then coming off a submission defeat in Japan. But you never want to count out Melvin Manhoof because all it takes is one puncher kick. There's the shot by Kennedy, the wrestler, background, and uh, Manhoof stuffing it. They tried to change the angle there. Good job nice. by Manhoof. That was nice. Okay. And the single leg spin and run. That's nice. nice. Take down avoidance by Melvin Manhoof. Maybe that secret training is paying off. It's working. And Kennedy does not like this because he does not want to deal with Manhoof's kicks. There's nobody out there that wants to deal with Manhoof's kicks. Manhoof had him nervous with those twitches and those little quick steps. It looked like he was faking a kick. That's what we should go back to and get Kennedy shooting far on the outside. I know, Frank, that you once told me you actually dreamt of knocking out Igor Zinoviev the way you did in rapid fashion. And at the fighter meetings, Tim Kennedy told us that he actually had a recurring dream of that he would knock out Manhoof via slam takedown. That's what he said. I believe it. But man, uh, this Manhoof is really proving to be a, a, a tough uh, nut to crack here in the wrestling department so far. Pat, you know about wrestling. He's got the perfect man who has the perfect body type for wrestling. Short, stocky, like like compact. You can't get in on him. Very powerful hips. I mean, he's doing a good job. Obviously, I, he's been working on it. And I like the patience he's exhibiting. Yep. Oh. Counter right hand by Manhoof, timed that kick perfectly. Kennedy delivered the kick, but he was met immediately with the counter right. That's the thing with good Muay Thai guys. If you throw a kick, you better expect something coming back because they are on you. Especially that Dutch style of Muay Thai. And oh, wow! That <laughs> kick just chopped Kennedy's leg down. Kennedy took it, bounced back up. But wow, that's a, a taste of the power of Melvin Manhoof, who is beginning to tenderize the lead leg of Tim Kennedy. Kennedy has got to set up his takedowns with some punches. And again the shot, and again the sprawl by Manhoof. Obviously, Kennedy wants nothing to do with Manhoof in the stand-up. Manhoof working the wizard. Kennedy now feeding him a couple of right hands. Manhoof almost turned that corner before his back got put on the cage. And there, Kennedy secures the takedown. And now, let's see, because this is where Manhoof has always had difficulty. His Achilles heel from his back. And that was the difference there for Manhoof. He did a good job initially stopping the first attempt, but it was the transitions that he couldn't stop, and that's where the experience of a good wrestler like Kennedy will pay off. Five of his eight losses have come via submission. Kennedy now has his back, looking to put his hooks in. Manhoof's got to get his back back on the mat. He's better off being side-mounted than being here. He's trapped in the cage. Kennedy right on top of him. Full mount, Kennedy looking to rein in the right hand. Manhoof flattened out now, and some ground and pound from the back. Manhoof trying to block. Kennedy does not want Manhoof to get back up, trust me. He is staying on him right here. He wants to finish this kid. And Kennedy has power of his own. Referee Matheny warning him to watch the back of the head, going for the rear Under naked the choke. He just got to get a little bit more out of that chin. Man. Kennedy has six win. Make that seven wins via submission as he picks up his second career victory via rear naked choke. He defeated Trevor Prangley last June in Los Angeles. And Tim Kennedy with an impressive submission win weathered the early storm from Melvin Manhoof. And his military brethren salute him as Tim Kennedy earns an impressive win looking for revenge. He wants the match against middleweight champion Jacare. Well deserving of it after a performance like that. Yeah, 
I mean, he went out, he had, to, he had to take a little bit of abuse to get the job done. But once he got him there, hey, he's a finisher. He's a, he's a killer. Yeah, great power, too. I like his strength inside. And I was impressed with Matt Hoop's ability to wrestle and make those quick tor uh, turns and corner changes. That's where the wrestlers always got me. I could make one change, they'd make two or three, I'd fall over. Matt Hoop did really well. But it started out, he survived this just massive leg kick. And Kennedy tried to block, he saw him turn his knee, but it just blasted his leg right out from underneath him. That's power. That's power, man. And here's the wrestling game where, you know, Matt Hook was winning a bit. I mean, he had the shoulder down, but as soon as his back was on the cage, he was really done. And Kennedy just followed it down, stuck his knees behind him and tripped him over. And once he was in this position, this is where I knew Mel was gonna have some trouble. Uh, but positionally, he just never advanced. And here's the choke. I mean, he slowly advanced up. He got underneath his chin. It wasn't the best position. Melvin Hanhoff hung on pretty good. He looked like he was going out because that's a slow tap, man. That's a slow tap. <laughs> he didn't want. He didn't want it. I love Melvin, man. I can't believe that. I mean, I think he's so ingrained in kickboxing that it's just a struggle for him. There's our boys, Ranger up. Army is here in force. seconds in round number one a rear naked oak choke ends this contest as the fighter taps out he is the winner by way of submission tim kennedy congratulations congratulations